Seen a guy play so long without one shoe? No, I didn't even. I didn't even notice. I didn't even you notice. notice? Happened, yeah, okay. I was just so locked in. But yeah, I mean, he can do anything. I think he scored like three in a row early, yeah. early on. So he can do a lot. So. How frustrating was that you guys kind of did repeat the same pattern you did at LSU? Didn't really get going there in the first half all that much, and uh, uh, you certainly flirted the losing to a, to a bottom feeder here today. But, For sure. Uh, yeah, it's very frustrating. Um, just kind of have to figure out a way to be consistent offensively and defensively for 40 minutes. We put it together a couple times this year, but that's just kind of the, 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 the thing that we're trying to put together. Every, every game we're trying to put 40 minutes together, consistent offense, consistent defense. So we're still working, and, and we can still get better. Well, defensively, that doesn't seem to be an issue. I mean, defensively, you do put 40 minutes together. Mm -hmm. It seems like on the offensive end, that's where the struggle well, there there are some lapses you probably wouldn't notice, but there, there are definitely some lapses on defense that we, we can definitely uh, get together. But also, offensively, we got to continue to work too. Just stay in the lab and get shots up and finish the contract and get, try to get to the line and finish free throws as well. Do you feel the struggle out here today had anything to do with any kind of hangover from the euphoria of, of your best win of the year on the road? Or? Uh, I hope not. Um, Coach White thinks a little bit, maybe, uh, us handling success. Uh, obviously, that was a really big win against LSU, but uh, I feel like today was a really big win, too. Any, any win in the SEC is huge, so uh, I'm just so excited we got to get it done today. You talked about defense being a big uh, confidence builder for your team. On offense, Andrew Nemhard leading your team. What do you have to say about him, the way he's able to stay composed at the end of a game like this today? Oh, he's a magician. Um, he's, he's getting guys shots, getting into the lane every possession. Um, very few turnovers. He has a thousand assists probably already. So just just a magician with the ball and takes care of it too. Um, so he's just going to continue to get better, and he's definitely done a good good job so far this year. Early on in the year, a game like this, it might have ended differently. Yeah. It seems like the last few games, you got more fight towards the end. What was yeah. the turning point for this team mentally to kind of hang in like this and fight in that energy throughout the whole game? It just took us some time to mature. mature. And uh, once that happened, we were, we were pretty resilient. And now I feel like we can kind of withstand any any ups and downs throughout the game. So I feel like we'll be fine. How satisfying has this been for you personally? Because I know you struggled at the beginning of the season. And this is your final year here. Mm -hmm. You guys as a group are starting to come on now. Yeah. The NCAA is still a possibility. But yeah. yourself, how satisfying is this? Uh, I don't ever really want to be satisfied, but uh, I'm definitely happy with the last four games, uh, us being able to come together and get these last four, four wins. Like I said earlier, that any game in the SEC is a, is a big game, and we were able to, to, to get another one tonight. So we're just, just so fortunate.